we've recognized that uh, some of the bus shelters and bus stops in Saskatoon are not great. They're not uh, friendly for people that are using strollers. In particular, they're not friendly for people that are on wheelchairs or scooters or anybody that's uh, challenged mobility-wise. And one of the things we want to do is we want to engage the public of the city of Saskatoon in showing us where we can spend some of the dollars that we're getting from the PTIF fund from our partners with the federal government, uh, which is sponsored by our, the province of Saskatchewan uh, administered that way. So what we want to do is we want to try and get about 20 of our bus stops uh, with shelters this year as a result of where the citizens of Saskatoon tell us the greatest need is. So we're doing a social media campaign because we thought it would be fun in that go to school, getting back to school sort of atmosphere. This is one of those things that we can help get ready for winter before it gets cold outside. So what we're asking people to do is go on social media, do the uh, hashtag bus stop YXE and give us a, either a photo or a description of a shelter that they think is in blue shape, sorry shape, something that they would like to see us fix. As I say, we've got uh, about $300,000 out of the uh, PTEF funding that's been given for uh, network access to the city of Saskatoon. It's a total budget of about $1.5 million, of which $300,000 we get to put towards shelters. So we can fix a lot of shelters and we can make sure that people have access to what they need to get access. So what we're looking for is uh, citizens from the city to engage with us, let us know where we should be putting some of this extra cash that we've been fortunate to receive.